Where in the world have you gone snorkeling and being transported to another planet? This week in the far out island of Falanga, we take a dive into another universe where the corals and the sea creatures of the Pacific put on an absolute display of colors. Now being a part of the village, we follow their weekly routines by attending the local church on the small island. Then we make the most out of our last afternoon by attempting one last mission to discover weird shells and delicious coconuts. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you. Hello. Hello. Sorry, you can't do much but smile when you're looking around. It's just, it's just incredible. We just re-anchored to this amazing spot. I really wanted to go here and be amongst the little mushrooms as Kieran calls them. Is it recording? Oh, it We're is. just smiling. <laughs> but look at it! It's unreal! We've re-anchored this morning, uh, literally maybe a mile away from where we were. Yes. But uh, we wanted to be near the mushrooms, didn't we, yes. babe? Yes. Not actual mushrooms, but islands that we're actually dubbing the mushrooms. Yeah. Oh, it's so cool. So this morning we are going for a drift dive. So the actual pass that we use to enter this beautiful, beautiful lagoon and this beautiful island, it has current going in and out of it every day which um, the water kind of fills up the lagoon when it's high tide and then when it's low tide it empties the lagoon through this pass. So it's huge, we've heard good things about drift diving it um, and I've, been, I've wanted to do it since we got here mm. and so we're going to be going and doing that right now. Yes, I'm a little bit scared, just a tiny bit. Cause Why? There could be sharks. I'm counting on there being sharks. Not big ones though. <laughs> we're going to be taking the dinghy in our hand so if we get, if the current takes us out of the lagoon or into the lagoon, whatever it may be, um, we can jump in the dinghy and make our way back into our boat, back into or the lagoon. if there is a big shark, we can jump in the dinghy and save ourselves from the big shark. <laughs> yes, that also. Highly unlikely, but that also. Are you the, uh, the driver today, my love? This is your uh, transportation to the pass this morning? This, um, Isabel's taxi service? Yes. Exactly. Uber, Isabel's stall. Am I getting in? Is that what you're doing? Take a seat. Sit back, relax. Leave your worries behind. Well, I like what See? it is. My, my, my uh, bullshit level has just gone way up there since being with BS. you. BS. I'm swearing on the show, babe. Come on. It's a children friendly program here. Okay, so we've um, we've come to the outside of the island, just out the front of the pass. We've timed it to absolute perfection. The current is going from the outside of the lagoon into it. Um, so we're going to get kitted up right now, jump in the water, and get dragged slowly into the lagoon and see what we see. I'm very much looking forward to it. By far, some of the greatest snorkeling we've experienced in our adventures has been in the untouched paradise of the Pacific Ocean. The island of Falunga, being so far from civilization, really shows off this pristine underwater world in all her beauty.
Hello. Good morning. Good morning. So this morning we are heading to a Fijian church service. Um, this will be our first church service in Fiji, and we've heard it's it's kind of their it's kind of their dress up day. It's a, it's a day of uh, really kind of coming together as as a people and as a village. Yeah. So we're very much looking forward to yeah. uh, experiencing it for the first time. Yeah. So the whole village gets together. I think they have a nice lunch afterwards. I'm very excited to see it and experience the the real Fijian church in a small little island. Take me to church. Shout it, do, do, do. Well, I'm gonna take you to church. Okay. 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 Let's go to church. Let's do it. In Fiji, Sunday is a time for the community of most villages to come together and celebrate their religion. On this day of Sabbath, no work, farming or fishing is undertaken. There are flippers. For who? For, for, for Noah. Why Noah? For Noah. I was told to leave them here. Is that okay? Hey, just leave it there. Yeah, After church, we sat down with our host family, Setta and Panika, to be treated to some delicious lunch. On the menu was fresh fish mixed with veggies, cassava, a local root vegetable, and crab. Very happy chappies. The food is ready, so let us pray. Lord, we thank for the food we have today. Bless to us, in the name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. Ah. Enjoy yourself. Everything had been caught and grown on the island by the community which we felt so connected to. Being one of the last days on Falanga, before we had to move on to the next island, we were really trying to soak everything in as much as possible. We know in our minds that we'll likely never return to this remote haven, and it was our intention to capture as many internal screenshots as we could. What are we doing? We've just come to this beach. <laughs> Try and find some coconuts and some shells. Coconut and shell hunting. How about this it? beautiful little beach. Shells, my favorite. Yay. <laughs> I really like shells. Um, I was just amazed by that big shell that I found the other day. And I just, yeah, I just want to have a look and maybe I can find another one. Flatten that guy down to a pancake and he survived somehow. What do you want about? There is one thing which I hate. Like, I hate with a passion. I'm a pretty nice guy, I don't hate many things, but mosquitoes, like swarming mosquitoes. These guys are pretty, like, they don't, they don't itch too much when they bite, but I still just get so paranoid. I hate them. I hate them.
Oh, no. Too bad. Oh.